I'm going to demonstrate another exercise routine that I've evolved over many years. I've got a rebounder here, which are common on the market. This is a very good one, and it's got a lot of give, a lot of yield to it. So here's the exercise. And this is to strengthen the arms and the core, the whole core of the body, and also the balance. This is a compressed files of exercise, because it doesn't take very long. And here it is. You get a nice, smooth rhythm. Now you notice that you automatically shift your weight from leg to leg as you're moving the dumbbells. It's a very controlled move. But your whole body is activated. Everything is activated simultaneously. It's a core builder. I can feel it through my whole body. So I do about 20 of those. So that's about 10 for each arm. Then, without stopping, I swing one dumbbell up and I get 10 of these. Nice and smooth. Always balanced to both sides. And again, you're on this yielding surface, so it's dynamic. You're not really at the muscle fatigue state yet, so you need to do another 10 and 10. It comes out to 20. So it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 18, 19, 20. Then, still not fatigued, you do this one. This is called a tricep extension and strengthens the triceps of the arm, the tool that the arborist uses to pull the pole saw. So again, a little forward bend and curl up, extend. 10 of those. Now you're starting to feel it. Your arms are going to burn a little bit. And the last thing an arborist wants to lose is their grip. So here is the grip move. You've already exercised your arms. You've got a little bit of a burn. And then the only precaution is don't drop one of these on your foot. But you can open your hand a little and curl. Open, curl. Three, four. There we go. Now you're feeling a little bit of a burn. And that's the point. For the body to get stronger, for the muscles to get stronger, you have to take them up to a point of fatigue, not a point of pain or suffering or injury, but to a point that you've really worked those muscles, you've told them you're going to demand this strength out of them, and then they respond. So you're sending a strong signal physically, you know, mentally to the whole body that this full strength is going to be demanded from time to time. And then the body will lay down the tissue, it'll lay down the strength, it'll build the tonus for that move if you ask it of it each day. And so that's my trick is to do it every day. I try to never miss and then you've built strength, you've signaled the body to be strong, and the body responds. We can't just exercise once in a while and expect the body to measure up to the demands. It's got to be a rhythm that is continuous and ongoing. We send the same signal every day, and then the body responds. In all sports, in all athleticism, there's this necessity to repeat the exercise, repeat the knowledge, so that it's ingrained and it becomes dedicated to the body's structure.